Hi guys, Peter Finch here with Rick Shields and this is the next Ryder Cup Golf Bidder Challenge and it is time after the longest drive, which I won't tell you the result of, but please make sure you do go check that out. It is now nearest the pin time. Yes, so we have hooked up with our good friends at Golf Bidder and they have sent over two sets of iconic golf clubs that are featured in the Ryder Cup. We had a draft picks on Pete's channel, which I'm sure you've already seen, and we divvied out the golf sets accordingly. And we've just done the longest drive. I was on my channel, like Pete said, go and watch it. Now we're going to do his nearest pin. We're going to have three holes of varying different lengths at a golf course that is actually not a real golf course. No, Blue Bayo. No, Blue Bayo is a proper golf club. Blue Bayo Golf and Fishing Club. All right. Members, if you want to get us over there for a real course vlog, we amazing. will be more than uh, more than happy to oblige. And we're going to be picking three holes on the golf course, nearest pin on every single one of those par threes, and the overall winner will win this second challenge. Now, as it's my channel, as you're the guest, I will allow you to go first. And Goodness. the first hole here is 168 yards over water, trees everywhere, very difficult. And what club are you going to be hitting? I'm going to hit a 7-iron because in the little practice that we did beforehand, I actually hit a 7-iron and it was almost bob on the correct club for 168. Um, but adrenaline's pumping now, so happens in the Ryder Cup. Might have to go pitching match. It's very uh, true. You do look pretty <laughs> damn pumped up right now. So I'm using Patrick Reed's Callaway irons, the, cal the irons that he dominated the 2016 Ryder Cup at. Uh, I think it was the Shush 2014. No, it was Grand Eagles. It was. Or was it? Was it uh, 2016? I've got to be honest. He just pulls it out all the time now. It's the actual point in time where that was first produced. No one knows anymore. It's like one of those mythical things. <laughs> so we're just right. doing one shot each nearest one, the pin. One shot each nearest pin. One six eight. Have to go a tiny bit. I thought I was alright actually. Go on, kick left a wee bit. Hey, you're on the green. Back. You're on the green. Very, very nice. So 165 yardage and what's that? Seven, eight, eight yards offline. Eight yards offline. A 165 off total distance. So I took a little bit too much off it. Hmm. We have to almost. It doesn't actually give you actual nearest the pin number, so we have to almost. Uh, just do it by eye. Yeah, of course. Just you do it by eye. Just do it by who thinks you hit the best shot. And I am using. Viewer's choice. <laughs> and I am using Mr. Luke Donald's irons. So MP64s. Obviously, nothing feels like a Mizuno. The only probably issue with this is you're using US irons and I'm using Europe irons. If you've seen the team selections, I am very much team USA. So, what is this? I'm actually using way more US product. Mm. Bubba's drivers, Mickelson's wedges, Patrick Reed's irons. <laughs> um, who's well, favourite was it? Sergio Garcia's. Closet. You're a closet US fan. That's the issue. If you want to openly switch allegiance now, I don't mind. No way, no way. If you way. want to abandon Europe, that's okay. No way. All right. Europe might want to abandon me. <laughs> they might do their own Brexit on me. <laughs> After R this. Rixit. <laughs> Rixit. <laughs> right. Pete, to get close in that, to take challenge and we'll Looks online. Is it the right distance? Oh, it's a fantastic. Not your first hole in one right now. Oh, oh, Peter Finch. Oh my goodness, I just can't compete anymore. That's awesome. Do we want to just check the stats no, just to see which one's closer? Guys, comment or? below who do you think won that first one? Who do you think got closer? Let's go on to round two. A great shot. Okay, so hole number two, we've come to the 13th hole. It's playing a little bit shorter, 150 yards. Um, pin tucked right over water again. Are you sure this is a real golf course? I'm, 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 I'm almost sure it's a real golf course. I, I might, I'm not sure if I just want it yeah, to I, be a real golf course. It doesn't seem like it should be. Uh, Pete, you're going to go first this time. So 150 yards, what are you going to hit with the Mizunos? I mean, that was 168 with a 7 iron. So I'm between probably a 9 and an 8 here. I don't want to force it too much, but I think just a, a solid 9. I think a solid 9 should do me here. Yeah, it should be fine. These, these both sets of irons aren't overly strong and I can't expect them to hit the ball too far. We'll switch it. You switch to eight. Okay. Good a little, little knock down with my eight. I don't want to force it. Guys, we filmed this quite early in the morning. I don't want to go forcing <laughs> anything too much We've used that now. excuse quite a few times now so far. <laughs> and it always works. So a little eight iron. Very Luke Donald-esque swing here, I think. Get on it. Very Luke Donald-esque. Get on it. 
Off the bank oh, at the back, yeah. off the bank at the back. Oh, it's a tiny bit long. It's too long. Big, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. So that's seven yards too long and... Pretty much bang on line. 1.3 off line, so 8.3. 8.3 offline. Someone intelligent will be able to work out the, what's, what's that? Mathematical length and width. Pythagoras Pi, theory. If we knew what the Pythagoras theory would be, we'd know exact distance. But anyway. Um, so it's seven go. yards long, just offline. <laughs> Only got nine iron. This is a nice one of these for this me. Is, this is why we took up golf, guys. Because <laughs> <laughs> we can't count. We did excel in the classroom. It's going to have to go a little bit. Slightly right, but I think you're better for distance. Oh, I don't oh, know. I'm not sure. One, four, four. So that's six yards offline, but I am wider. I think these little fadey shots. Uh, nine yards offline, so that would be Pythagoras theory would tell me that Pete would win that challenge. <laughs> Number two, two nil up in the series. Good work. I love that, that shot shape you hit. It was very... Bullet straight. Gentle, gentle. <laughs> right. Uh, right, hole number three, which one are we going for, Pete? We'll go 17. Okay. We'll go 17. I think this is a little bit trickier. I think we're going to bend this round a tree. Oh, wow. And so, do a little bit of a flyover of this bad boy, and it is. This isn't a real golf course, Pete. Come on. I think it is. I honestly think it is. I, I hope it is. It's I terrible. really hope it is. There's a boat in the water. Right? Anyway, boats, boats can be in water. <laughs> um, a hunt, it's longer this one. Yeah. 196 yards to the flag, requiring a right to left shot shape. Yeah, now this isn't my forte in any way. Um, and these have been going a little bit further, so I'm going to go five. Okay. I'm just going to try and hit that little bit of a draw. I need to summon up my, uh, my Rory feeling from, uh, from earlier on. From the longest drive video. Just in there. Curve it around that tree. Oh, it's done it. It's a bit, it's a oh, that's bit very a good. Bit. Very good, Peter. Finch. Oh, no, no, no. fire. Go and play the golf tournament tomorrow. In yeah. Ireland, he's ready. <laughs> yeah, yeah it, is, it is a Euro Pro event, though, so that would be laughed at, actually, there. I, that'd be scowled at. That's like an 18 handicapper shot of the Euro Pro, I think, at the moment. What did you hit? Uh, five iron. Drew uh, it round. Just, you can see there how it just cleared the branch uh, that I was aiming for. Now this going, this going against everything that I'm trying to work on in my golf game at the moment, because I'm trying to hit slicey fades for days. This is like and old, this got, is old Ricky. I've got to sling it. Here's Ricky. So I think hole out for the win. <laughs> yeah, I think, I think hole out wins. Pretty, yeah, I think that's universal rules there, hole out wins. Oh, I'll tell you what. Look at that ball fight. Coming back. Huge. Go back, go back, go back. Off the bank. Oh! That means classy when you just go off that bank. I like the shot shape. I feel like I'm getting accustomed to these irons in many different ways, even though I lost the challenges 3 0. Guys, thanks for watching. Hopefully, you enjoyed the video. It's just like, you're just on it at the moment. I've, it's like, how, how do you. I need to learn how to hit the ball straight again. <laughs> Listen, it's just one of those things. I thrive early in the morning. That excuse of I've been early in the morning, that's gone for me now. <laughs> I've actually realised I've played my best golf at this time. So guys, thank you so, so much for watching. Absolutely loving these challenges. Thank you to our friends at Golf Bidder for helping sort this out. We are absolutely... Well, I'm, I'm, I'm really looking forward to getting out on the course now, despite the... Um, Drizzle, which is in the air. If you are new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you subscribe to Rick as always and follow us in our social media, which is all linked in the description below. And we will see you down here next time. I'll give your editor something to do. Crown. <laughs> the crown.